so I just finished sketching the second character for my new coffee brand and in the beginning I actually started with uh, this sketch as you see right here and um, I don't know it just felt kind of boring I don't know I just wasn't really feeling it so I thought yeah I need to push things around a little bit push the shapes make it weird and I ended up with this sketch, which I think just uh, a little bit more fun and exciting for me to uh, draw. And it's uh, pretty much in the same style of the crocodile from last time. So um, yeah, I think I'm good to go. I'm gonna take it into Illustrator and uh, start the coloring process. to grab hold to the microphone got him not in the lawn maybe she'll save the world for me maybe she'll right my wrongs if i'm coming on too strong oh well only way to tell is by saying this how i feel and that's real Okay, great. So these two actually work really nice together. Yeah, I like it. Uh, I think uh, the process was just so much easier this time since I already knew the colors I'm, I'm gonna use and the style to aim for from the beginning pretty much. So yeah, it was super easy and fun. Really enjoyed this one. Um, and now I just feel like uh, I need to, to give it another go with the package design. I don't know, taking, I, I just took another look at it today. It felt like, um, yeah, maybe I have like too many details and everything is like too much. And I think I wanna go with a cleaner, just simpler design. So I'm gonna try and uh, maybe just remove some elements and see um, what's gonna happen. Yeah, okay, this is pretty nice. Um, yeah, I like it. I think, uh, well, <laughs> I pretty much ended up with the same composition I started with last time when I felt like um, it was a bit too boring, but <laughs> I don't know, now it just feels like um, maybe it's enough details for the front side of the package. And, you know, I'm, I'm my own client in this project, so I can, I can change my mind. I can do whatever I want. <laughs> so... Um, yeah, I think it's pretty nice. I like the, the black background here with the zigzag line. I think it's, it's working pretty well with the illustration. And I don't know, I just like the simplicity of it all. So um, I just want to try uh, to use just a completely different color palette now. I just want to, you know, I, I have some interesting pink references here. 
inside uh, Photoshop uh, and uh, yeah I just feel like yeah, just going out there and just do, some, do something completely different with the design and, and use like a lot of pink so <laughs> I'm just gonna try it out for a sec and uh, let's see what happens. Okay, okay, so this is pretty awesome. Yeah, yeah, I like it a lot actually. I love how, you know, the colors can change the entire atmosphere of the design in, in an instant, you know. I just love how everything feels so much different now. And um, my only concern right now is, the, um, well, the design is a bit too clean and empty. I know I removed a lot of like noise and a lot of elements and I like it, but I, I feel like maybe just um, I need to add some sort of uh, like a pattern or something to go behind the illustration, it just feels a bit empty. So I'm gonna try and create a pattern maybe with uh, the same shape I use for the zigzag line and we'll see how it goes. Okay, so these are actually super nice. I really like the doodle line. I think it adds a lot of fun to the design. And it also, it's an interesting contrast. The, the font of the logo is like super thick and heavy. And the doodle line is so thin and fun and quick. And I just like this combination. It's, it's really interesting for me. So I'm gonna use, I'm gonna keep on using it. And I think it's actually, um, as, as this graphic element, I can have this do the line as a graphic element that I use in different designs for this brand in the future. So I'm pretty happy about um, this doodle idea. And now my main problem right now is actually the mock-up, which doesn't look good. I'm definitely, I need to fix that. So I'm gonna try and just maybe use a different angle. Can hopefully this will be it and I can wrap the package design process. <laughs> this time for good, so uh, yeah, let's try and do that. <laughs> Okay, so this was so much fun, you guys, and the pink, yeah, it's pink, guys. It's definitely pink. <laughs> I'm not changing any more colors. I'm, I'm very happy about it. And so I think 
the pink is like the base color that is gonna be like the main brand color and then each package is gonna have its own um, like it's, it's different flavors so each flavor is gonna have its own dark color and this is how the series is gonna work uh, with like multiple packages so yeah super happy about it and I wonder what you guys think so leave a comment if you have any thoughts about this I'd love to hear your thoughts and I think this is definitely yeah too much stuff for one episode so I'm gonna wrap this up and see you next time bye bye